Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Joey Biagas and I'm a digital media expert. And today I'm gonna to show you how to compress an MLV file. So let's get to it. Okay, so I'm gonna be using a program called Adobe Media Encoder. And that's part of the CS Suite. All right, so what I'm gonna do is throw in a MOV that I have on my desktop right here. And I'm just gonna throw that into the program by clicking and dragging. Perfect. So to adjust the compressor settings, we can just select the preset right here. Click on that and that should open up the window. Perfect. So let's just start, start from the top, format. Now usually when you're compressing video, it's to upload to YouTube or something like that because you want a smaller file. So I would suggest using H.264 because it does compress it fairly small and uh, results in a fairly good quality. So let's go ahead and let me show you that example. So H.264, you, you can do a number of different files, but for this example, I'm gonna use H.264. And the presets are really great in this. Um, it gets you up and going really fast. So depending on what video you want to export it as, and the, one of the most common ones, which is what my video is right now, is HD. 1080p 29.9 .9 high quality so of course whatever format you want um, just select accordingly okay and that from there we can pretty much export this now as a compressed file but what I do want to also note is you want to focus on the video tab and the audio tab from here you can tweak it to your own liking if we scroll down because we want to basically keep the uh, pixels at where they're at and the frame rate where it's at but if you look at the bit rate, um, we can compress this larger or smaller. So if we want to compress a larger file, um, if you have a larger file, it'll be better quality. And we can slide the slider back to a higher number as well as the target bit rate. But if we slide them forward with a smaller number, it's going to compress it and create a smaller file. Now that's great if you want to upload fast, but not necessarily the greatest quality. So just kind of keep that in mind. And same thing for the audio. If we cruise down, we have the bit rate down here. So the smaller the number, the smaller the file, and vice versa. Okay, but we're pretty much good here. And I can just go ahead and go down to OK, and hit OK. And then once that is done, all I do is hit Enter on my keyboard. And then it will start compressing and export the file. So there you guys go. That's pretty much it in compressing an MOV file. If you do have any other questions, please let us know and thank you for watching.